Hey everybody, Ethan the Super Mario fan here, and look what just came today. The Sony DVD player. Yes, it just arrived today. Yes, it is an HDMI one. This is the same one Blake the SpongeBob fan has. So anyways, here's the front, spine, other spine, top. The bottom and the back. At the back, it just shows like French language, I think, or Spanish. I don't know. It, yeah, it does have 1080p upscale and it does have HDMI. As you can see, the box is a little is damaged on the front and the the front and the thing. But anyways, that's okay. So, oh, sorry, I walked. But anyways. I'm going to unbox this, so anyways, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Sorry, I had to take a one-minute break, but anyways, I had to get scissors. So anyways, let's unbox this thing. I don't want to make sure to unbox it too... I don't want to unbox this thing too deep to get the thing damaged. Hold on. It's kind of hard to unbox it on while holding the phone. It's going to be hard. Okay, I think I got that. So anyways, I'm going to open it up. Yep, Sony, bring your DVDs to life with amazing 1080p upscaling. So anyways, here's the manual. Here's the remote. Sadly, <gasps> wait a minute, it comes with batteries? Oh my god, it comes with batteries. That means I can be able to test this thing on that TV. And as you can see, you can see the Mario movie over there, which I'll use that for the testing video, for example. Whoa, oh my god, this thing comes with batteries. Okay, <gasps> color cords! Wow, it comes with color cords! Wow! That means I can be able to use my CRT TV to, to connect it. Wow. But anyways, here it is, guys. The DVD player itself. Sadly, it doesn't come with an HDMI cable, but I do have one, though. So, I'll use that. So, anyways, here it is, guys. The DVD player itself. I'll put... Whoa. The reason why my voice is a little bit different, it's because, not like usual, it's because I just woke up, like, minutes ago. That's the reason why. Here it is. See, anyways, it's in good condition. Wow. It also supports HDMI because I'm going to use the HDMI for that TV because sadly this thing doesn't support color cords. But it does come with AV cords. I know you could still use AV cords, but I'm probably going to have to buy like an AV adapter for that TV so I can use the color cords for the thing. So anyways, I'll put the batteries in the remote and I will get the HDMI cable from my room upstairs to connect this thing. So anyways, I'll be right back. Okay. I got the thing hooked up, and I put batteries in the remote already. So anyways, let's turn this on for the moment of truth. Whoa. 
Whoa! Oh my goodness, look at that! It even shows the Sony logo as well. And then it switches to DVD player. So anyways, I'm going to be testing out a DVD on this thing. Yep. I'm going to be testing out a DVD. So anyways, for this example, I'm going to be testing out the Super Mario Brothers movie, for example. The, the DVD standard version hasn't arrived yet. Sorry if you can see Pepsi and Starry cans right there, but I apologize for that. Sorry if it's blocking the way. Sorry if it's dirty. So anyways, for the moment of truth, let's test this thing. Wow, it even kind of sounds like the other DVD players like Maiwani and Samsung. And yes, I will do videos with this thing. Whoa, it sounds very good. Sorry if you can barely hear the volume. All right, yeah, that was the Universal 2012 logo, but on the Sony DVD player. So, yeah, because I love Super Mario so much, just want to let you know. So, yeah. Yeah, because the DVD-only version hasn't arrived yet, but it arrives this week. So, yeah. So anyways, I hope you have enjoyed this DVD player unboxing. I know it's been a while since I've done it. So anyways, if you have enjoyed this DVD player unboxing, make sure to give a like. Make sure to give a like on the video. Comment, share my videos, subscribe if you're new, and click the notification bell icon when you get notified when I upload more content in the near future. So until then, peace out.